Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. My name is Neil with bikepacking.com and today is super exciting because we are starting our short series. In this series, we are going to chat about a topic or product for roughly three minutes or so, give or take. And today, we are going to start with the Phoenix BC21R. I've used a bunch of Phoenix lights over the past five years, and this is probably my favorite one. The Phoenix BC21R is in its second iteration, and it is a huge upgrade over its predecessor. The 2.3 ounce slim down rechargeable light has a max output of 1000 lumens over two hours and has a low setting of 50 lumens over 30 hours. However, after using this light during ultra races this winter, I found myself in the most efficient 150 lumen setting for climbs, which will get you roughly 13 hours. And then I was on the high setting for descents, which puts out about 400 lumens over six hours. I'd say the biggest standout feature from the previous version though, is the mount. The first generation mount was horrible. The new quick release mount is much more solid and adjustable. It also works well both upside down and right side up. It comes with a variety of shims to fit different diameter bars, but it does max out on 31.8 mil bars. The light is updated with a USB-C charge port to recharge the provided 2600 milliamp hour battery, which takes roughly 2.5 hours to charge. With the ability to replace the battery with CR123s or a different 18650 battery, this light is more capable than other rechargeable lights on the market. Another nice feature is this battery indicator light, which showcases how much battery life you have left. The light has held up during winter riding and commuting through rain, snow, and everything in between. The Phoenix BC21R has proved to be a worthy addition to the cockpit. From bikepacking trips to racing to commutes, it will have a continued home there. The light comes in at a reasonable $79.95, and if you want to purchase this light today, you can do so by clicking the link below. If you have any comments or questions regarding the BC21R, I will be happy to help answer those for you, so please leave them in the comment section below. And if you haven't done so already, please hit that subscribe button. That will ensure each one of our videos pops up in your feed. And thanks for watching as always. And until next time, pedal further.